Mr. Brian Barnes, a resident of Onoto Bay, says after giving an explanation to the security forces at the checkpoint, he was allowed to go home. However, he is lamenting that because of a quarantine, he now has no market for his goods. I'm going to the market, coronation market last night, buy the goods them all sale. I know I'm coming, you know, I have, have everything bag up and tie up and put on. Can't sell, so they're going to have a squirrel car, perishable item. And as a poor man, you know, find yourself with a hundred thousand and go buy some stuff. And end up with a tight and put it on for you go and perish. Right? It's hard. And you don't know where you all get the money again for go back and buy your sack. You know, so we need something to happen urgent. We'll know one day when they say, all right, market day, Friday, Saturday. And you try to sell out, you can sell out and lock down back. Mr. Barnes says he agrees with the quarantine. What the government have done is right. Our uncle need a little, you know, tell us uh, it's going to take place. But I guess why I'm surprised like that is because I know one about the runway. Yes. So, I understand. I understand. I watch TV and we hear news and things like that. So, when we know so we go on, go on, and we know a lot of corona people are around. How does the, the people in the community react to this? They don't react no way, you know. They understand, you know, because they know the crisis. And I don't know surprise them. They know. No, I don't see like nobody react no way. I don't hear nobody that say uh, nothing that's, you know, bad. You know, everybody know the crisis. I know what's going on. Our news center spoke with two residents of Orange Bay, Portland, who were stranded in an Otto Bay Square this morning. They explained that they entered the community sometime after 5 o'clock to go to the health center. Clarence Vernon says because of a quarantine, he was not able to see a doctor. The nurse said the, the doctor said he cannot come again. He said he get the patient. He said he go to the doctor and he said he was alone. And the doctor said he said he was too small alone. He okay. said he said he said he give me some pain. He said the nurse give me some pain pill. Mm-hmm. And go home and come up in due time and the curfew over. Mm-hmm. And then the other friend, friend said at least uh, five o'clock in the morning. Yeah? And they're standing there and they can't move. Yeah, I go home, nothing at all. After, after 10 now. Oshin Masters, Frontline News.